Oh baby, oh baby. Oh, let me see, let me see. Yes. You can definitely see the brick wall. We know we're in the right spot. Cell towers are big business, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of dollars. And this cell tower here on the property, yeah, that brings in some big business as well. Now for us, we're not benefiting from it, but the previous owners did. As a matter of fact, there was a lump sum payment of $100,000 given to the previous owner before she passed away. But the family only found $4,000. That means $96,000 are unaccounted for. So we thought what a hails of an idea to see if we could re-storage the love, see if we can find maybe possibly this this treasure is hidden somewhere here on the property. Today is all about trying to restorage the love and trying to find almost $100,000. George, we've been at Shady Oaks Campground for two months now. Uh -huh. That's two more months than we anticipated, but we loved it. Look, this is how long we've been here. We are literally <laughs> growing grass in our mat, okay? Now we gotta grow another kind of green because we've heard there's a hundred thousand dollars missing. Finally home. Surprise, another big day for us here at the ranch. We finally moved the camper from the campground, which was right around the corner here to the ranch. We got it all hooked up and leveled. We're, I think we're set for a while. You think we're ready to go treasure hunting? I'm ready. Let's see if we can find that treasure. I'm thinking we should probably start this search in the chicken coop. No way. That's where I would hide. I'd put all my eggs into one basket right there in the chicken coop. That's where eggs go. This is the inaugural exploration of the chicken. Look, there's chicken noodle, oh, chicken gumbo, a chicken dumpling. Look at that, there's, there's chicken little. Chicken little is right there. Yep, there she is. And then we've got another one. She's up here in the crack right now. She's hiding. But uh, it's finally time for them to stretch their legs from their chicken coop mansion and go have some fun. Look at these guys. They all came straight to work right over here at the shop. I guess they're gonna help, they're gonna help daddy get some work done today. That's my chicks. Jeremy, what are you doing? I'm building the chickens a mansion. So you see all this right here? Uh -huh. While the chicken coop here was good, I kept getting hit in the face with all these branches. Okay. I'm six foot. I couldn't get through all these additional doors. Okay. So there were things here, 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 and I'm going to build them nests just like they had in Ohio out of milk crates. So I've opened this all up. I think I'm still bleeding right here uh, from hitting bit, my head. A little bit. So I'm opening it all up. And when I'm done, they're going to have laying baskets. And we're going to have eggs for days. They're going to love it. They already do. All right. The nests are all set up. One for each of them. One. I can walk in here again. And we're taking some of the golf balls that we found. This is the lucky yellow one. Uh -huh. That's not a yoke. And we're putting them in the nest. So if any snakes ever get up in here, they, they swallow that golf ball like this. They're like, <laughs> oh. And they choke on it. So this will tell the chickens where to actually nest. They all have them. Look, they love it already. I completely and totally opened up the room for so many activities. <laughs> There's so much room for activities. Come on, babies. Come check out your new mansion. The expansion mansion. They're scoping it out. I think they love it. What do you guys think? One last final touch. George said she had to have it for the chickens. It's the baby bed. Look how happy they are. Oh, somebody just got up from a nap. 
These chickens are having a little too much fun with their new nest. Look at that. That's a that's probably a double yoker. And yes, laying babies in the baby crib. I just sit here and think and think and think. Where could the money be hidden? If it was hidden anywhere. I mean, I will stop at nothing to find this. Absolutely nothing. Here's what I can tell you. It was not in the toilet. Definitely, Definitely not, not in, in the, the toilet. toilet. I did find something in the piping, though. Here, here, come here, George. I did, and not, not money. Doesn't mean you can't make money off of it, but I did find something here in the piping. Look at this. Ooh. Now, we had to change the toilet because the fixtures are just destroyed by the well water, and it's leaking like crazy. We're just going with a new toilet. This toilet was so fertile they were growing plants. Ooh. That's how fertile it was. It's growing green. It's just not the green that we're looking for. It's not the money. There's no doubt we love this property, but that's what we bought it for, the actual property. We didn't buy it for the home. This is an old hunting cabin converted into a home, and there's little nooks and crannies anywhere and everywhere. We wanna be respectful of the past, but we also wanna pursue the future on this property. So today, we're gonna to have to take some walls out, and we're hoping the treasure comes flowing out as well. Let's go take a peek inside, George. Let's get to Treasure hunting? Destruction style? Demolish style? Demolishing? I don't know what you want to call it. Something like that. This area here, this is the main hub of the hunting cabin. And then everything was an expansion. You can see here, this is where we've been live streaming. This is another expansion. The whole screened in porch, another expansion. Check out this back here. This is all an expansion. You can see the lip here, more concrete. George already has a bunch of totes here as we've been sorting, but things such as this, you see this right here? This, like this. Ah! <laughs> Careful. Went ninja style on it, but it kicked back. Okay, things such as this, this wall, we don't need. As a matter of fact, come on back here, George. We don't need this wall. We don't, this is the old exterior. We don't need this wall. We don't need this Look at this. There's panels. There's things covered up. I mean, stuff you could hide everywhere. Look at this. This angle here. This angle here. This right here. This can all come out. This has got to be non-bearing. This. Look at George here. Look at this. There's a little flap right there. That's I think something. It's behind. Do you think it might be hidden behind there? Should I rip it off and find out? Yeah. I mean, any. Anything could be hidden anywhere. What you do you think that leads to? You know what? George, there's only one way to find out. You're going to jump through it? <laughs> oh, I found out. Where does it lead to? It leads out to the chickens outside. Oh, chicky poos. I saw so, one. Okay, I saw one. you know what I think this was? I think this is where an old air conditioning probably was. Now, from what I was told, this got converted into the master bedroom. Uh, so this area here, oh, let there be light. Let there be light. This there. area here ended up being the master bedroom. Come on over here, come on over here. Like, there's, here's something right here. There's topical Bible, digest the Holy Scriptures. We know, because you watch what the hails, people hide money in Bibles all, all the, time. the time. Just not this one. Just not this one. You, you might want to triple check. Okay, I'm triple checking. Okay. Nothing there, but we'll put that in your Bible a lot, okay? okay. But, uh, you know, even things like this, this is like a custom-made dresser. What we need to do, I mean, we're just not going to use this. Right, but this we definitely thing. want to check the bottoms of every drawer so, because people tape things in the weirdest spots. Here's what I'm thinking. And again, in the most respectful way possible. Remember, we bought the place. We own it. We're not trying to be disrespectful to anybody, but we can do whatever we want with it because we own it now. Right. We want to restore the love. We would love to find the $96,000 and give it back to the family. But there's really only one way we can do it. <laughs> oh, it's loose, George. It's we... loose. Okay, it's loose. It's strong like bull. Back there. Oh, what's that? 
Look at that. Oh, what is that? That is, there's a Visa debit card. Oh. Okay. All right, let's, I got her loose. So we can, this has got to come out because this room is going to be storage for uh -huh. you. We're going to convert this entire back part of the structure as warehouse space, this storage is space. all warehouse space. So all of this has to come out. All of this will actually be burned. Mm -hmm. So it's 49 degrees in Florida today. It is a little chilly. It is. And it's so, a bit nipply. Welcome to our bonfire. I'm not seeing anything. I'm not seeing anything. Nothing there. We don't need firewood. So we this was right this was attached to the wall, but no longer. Whoa, 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 I'm seeing stuff. Hold a second, I see names. Careful, careful, careful. I'm seeing names. Okay. There is I'll stuff stand back. behind here. There's more stuff slip behind. I'll stand Do you remember the one time we found the gold bracelet slip behind in the dresser? Yeah. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Uh happy anniversary. There we go. There's a happy anniversary happy card. Happy anniversary. And 2015. 2015. Let's see what we have here. It is to a special couple on your anniversary. Mm -hmm. Congrats on 30 years. Nice. nice. Okay. 30 years. That's 30 a years. long time. That is a long time. Kind of feels like that already between us, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. We're and going on our third year this upcoming July, and it feels like 30. Right, honey? You know the truth. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait, I saw another piece of paper. Yeah. There's another that's piece of paper. Not, that's like a junk mail. Bill. Oh. Okay, now I had to flip this over anyway. Anything under here? I'm not seeing anything there. Nothing. Okay, I got another idea. I got another idea. Now, this whole wall is coming out. We'll get to that. Okay. Look, here's a closet. I mean, there's a closet. There's this kind of framey thing. And lots of dust particles. I see something. What I see something. See? Right here, look at this. I see something. What is that? International Order Dingalings. Peacock 3649. Threes, threes and, and eights. Three bells, Peacock 25. Huh. Interesting. I have what absolutely does it all mean? no idea. No idea on that one whatsoever. All right, let me haul this all out of here and then we're going to start taking walls down. All right, I admit it. I made a huge mistake. I actually just threw a dresser, a drawer, a cabinet in the burn pile pit without actually looking for money under the drawers. Let's jump in the fire, and there is a fire going on, and let's see if there's any money hidden there. Here we go. All right, this is the one. There's the top. Okay, so we can see there's nothing underneath the actual countertop top. Let's flip her over. There we go. Flipping it over here. Now, okay. So we're good here. We know we're good there. And, all right, we're good. We're good there. See how curious that is right there? Mm -hmm. From my understanding, this whole area back here, and we're going to open this all up. This was all an overhang, which was then enclosed for our family to come to hunting and things along those lines. Now, the other thing we've been told is she actually had, she, if I hope I'm getting my story correct, but I, I believe it was cancer, which then caused, you know, troubling of the mind, dementia. And so that's one of the things that goes through my mind and goes, well, $96,000 could literally be in this wall and we could take this wall out. You know, George, I'd really like to swing the other way. Okay. Let's see. You what if I trade spaces? You know what? I think I take this wall out first. Okay. Hold on, right there. Ready? Uh-huh. Get it. Get it. Get it. to move. It, it is, is starting to move. Now, once we get this wall out of here, tons of dust particles. 
Yeah, not orbs. Once we get this wall out of here, we'll have so much more room. It's like beating a safe. Woo, the there it goes, there it goes. Something's in the wall. By the way, if this entire structure falls on us, it was a hails of a good ride. Thanks, guys. <laughs> All right. And something's in here. that. Insulation. You have insulation. Is there anything hidden behind it? I'm just going to tuck that right out there. Is there anything in here? Okay. Nothing. Insulation there. We're just gonna... Remember that wall that got all tough with me before? You're gonna get all Jackie Chan on the you wall? See that wall that got... Jackie Chan or Bruce Lee? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm getting older. I can't kick that high. <laughs> you might rip your pants. Don't rip your pants, it's already ripped. <laughs> yeah, that would be bad. Because you've already pooped yourself and you've already ripped the pants. Not in that order. Not particularly in that order, but it, it could happen in that order. So behind that wall, we've got more wall. Now, look already. By the way, there's no back door. So we're using this handy dandy window. So the window is To the throw back door. everything out and then that'll go into the fire pit. And then, We'll use the tractor, the bucket of the tractor, to transport everything. Yes. Our tractor's been at, very, very handy. Look at how much that opens this whole place up already. There's just so many room for activities. So much I mean, room for activities. We can do activities after activity after activity. <laughs> um, you might want to take it off the hinges first. Why would we do that? Maybe. Probably. Or do you have a more funner way? What we should have done is I should have wore big boots. Woo, look That's at you. That's what I should have done. I should have wore boots. Okay. What are you wearing now? Oh, you're hiking. Tennis shoes. So, we need that to come out. We're going to take, here, look over here. See all these, these weird nooks, corners, crannies, all of this. Look at that. There's a light switch there. Okay, all of this is coming out too. Look how much that already opens that up. And then, if you turn around and look all the way over there, mm -hmm. I mean, we're going to have some serious warehouse space. Yeah, we are. Once we open all this up. Mm -hmm. So, I'll tell you what. What next? Uh, let me get this wall out. Okay. And, and then, uh, once we get to this wall... We'll show unless we find something crazy in that wall. Deal? <laughs> Deal. All right, that works. All right, BRB. I don't know what that means. But... Be right back. Okay, we'll be right back. George is having the time of her life because she's <laughs> never actually seen real demolition. Except I've only on seen it on TV HGTV. on HGTV. Uh, this one's loose now. You think there's something behind that? There's only one way to find out. You know, a lot of our fans think that it could be hidden in the in the wood burner. We definitely have to look. The wood yes. burner. But I noticed out on the screen and porch, there's an access panel that goes to the back of the wood burner. That's where I would hide it. Mm. Let's see what's behind here. I'm gonna lightly. Anything? Nothing in that one. Nope. Nothing in that one. Okay, we will get to the wood burner. The wall's got to come out first. It's got to go. Yep. Jeremy? Jeremy, what you're doing in there? <laughs> wow. Talk about manhandling the door. That one got manhandled. <laughs> this shelf has to come out. You thinking what I'm thinking? Uh-huh. Hammer time! The whole, the, this is what we call the old granny hammer. Yeah! Yeah! Swing it in between the legs and boom. That was the old granny technique. I feel like my grandma would be proud. Yeah, she would be very proud. We do have a lot of adopted grandmas that have adopted us as their grandchildren. I think they would be proud as well. True. Let's draw it in the 
than steel, baby. <laughs> Stronger. Is that what you would do to the that. monkey bars at the gym? That. That is a one inch steel rod. Not now anymore. It's two. <laughs> <laughs> what used to be the closet is now more room for activities. Well, there could be money in here. There could be anything in there. Let's see. Oh, let's see. She's ready. <laughs> I mean, I've been doing both. You know what? Woo! This is one of my favorite ways to push trees down. Uh huh. Dead trees. Get up in here like this. Uh huh. And then... Ha! I broke the light, but we still got it, don't we? <laughs> now I can get it. the shelf. The shelf is finally out. There it's will be no elf eyes. on that shelf. <laughs> Definitely no elf on that shelf. Look at that. How precise. What precision you have to have to break the outer globe of a bulb, but not, but not the, the innards. <sighs> I think the light is shining on us today. We're about to find something epic. Some of these walls have electric outlets and light switches like right here. That's kind of one of the globe I broke. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna What we really should do, we should do a whole HGTV and just remount, but we're gonna build new too. So this is temporary housing. This is temporary HGTV. Episode. Temporary warehousing. Mm -hmm. So we'll have to pull that electric. Lots of dust particles. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of dust particles. We'll pull that and we'll just, we'll leave them hanging. Now for some of you right now, you're going, no safety hazard. It was hanging in the wall. It'll be fine hanging outside of the wall. <laughs> in the wall, it was on particle board, highly flammable. Outside of the wall, it's just got particles mm -hmm. everywhere. So it'll be completely and totally safe. We're gonna knock that out. We'll get the, we'll get the wires and the cords out of there as well. And those will just hangle dangle. We'll have all this open space. I gotta know what's behind here. We'll get there, we'll get there. Let's see what's behind door number three. Door number three. <laughs> anything? Anything? Just dust particles. Wood particles and dust particles. We do have another light switch, but I'll just do the same thing I did with the other one. We'll let it hangle dangle. Shouldn't be a big issue just punching that thing out like this. Right, here, we'll just. Tap, 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 tap. Little love tap. Little Be careful taps. not to get caught in the love trap. <laughs> Valentine's is coming up. You don't want to be getting caught in that love trap. It is the month of. I like that better. I it like looks that good right there. there. It's good decor. Break time, apparently. Hammer's done for right now. <laughs> now we know what's on the other side of this thing. It's you. It's -a me, a Jeremy. Jeremy. I can see clearly now. <laughs> the blinds are gone. You're creating more exit points. It's gonna be a bright, oh, bright, profitable day. New door, but you make look at that this. look so easy. Yeah, but look, huge difference huge, already. Huge, huge difference. Instead of these little cubbies, we now have this whole long warehouse space, and we're not even done taking everything down. I mean, I, I realize why they did what they did. They did it for a purpose and a function that served what they were doing. But our purpose and function is very, very different. We need wide open space to hold inventory for us to sell until we can build the 10,000 square foot warehouse. So all of it, all of it has to come out. Oh, even though 
we just put in $2,500 in a new pump for water, even that, that's gonna have to come out sometime soon too. Do you think maybe there could be money hidden down in the well hole? It could be anywhere. It literally, literally anywhere. could be anywhere. Let me get this wall down. I got some other ideas, especially, especially behind that stove. Yeah, this is going good. So many nooks and crannies. Look at this, George. Right here, another built-in shelf. Any of this could be a false backing. Over here, <clears throat> not even sure why this wall exists unless they made it for entertainment. Now, the other side of this wall, this would be the bearing wall of, actually, this is an add-on as well, but this is a bearing wall, and the other side was the overhang that was turned into the bedrooms. So that's where we've been beating over there. We're taking a little break, and this is where everybody thinks it is. Now, the pipe was actually loose, you remember? Because Brett and I actually scooted the stove up to attach the pipe because it's so cold today. It's 49 degrees in Florida. Although it's a million times better than being it in Ohio snow. It beats the cold snow up in Ohio. And the thing, look at that. What, is that a roll of toilet paper? Um, or is that can hold a second. candle? That's a side by side comparison. Yeah, vintage. Actually kind of vintage, vintage antique toilet paper, new. new. Yeah, that kind of looks that way. <laughs> um, lots of people, when I broke this story, I started to share, everybody was thinking, well, it's, it's in the stove, it's in the stove. Check underneath. And I didn't think, Anything. I didn't think when Brett and I moved the stove, that, that actual, the flue pipe, it was loose. So there was a gap and Brett came over and we pushed it right up close because we thought, well, this is the heat for the home and George is freezing. And what we should have been thinking was, Pull it all the way out, uh -huh. not put it all the way in, but there's an access panel. So you see this corner here? I noticed, here, come here, come here. Okay. Out on the porch, this is parts of the wall that we pulled out. By the way, mm -hmm. this is coming out, this is coming out, this is coming out. It's all coming out, everything. Open floor concept. Yep. We have to have open floor concept. All right, come on out here out on the porch. This is the party place. And by party, I mean in the middle of the night, I turn the lights on and I edit. I edit LED in a, lights. In a wreck, in a, in a chair, LED lights, a little bit of music. We've this been using the, the basket that I weave to put the chicken eggs in and then later on I hand wash them. Okay, that's my rain jacket. This, you see this? Oh yeah. This is an access panel to something. So I'm thinking while we're on break, I get the drill. Let's see what's hidden behind here. What do you say? Let's do it. All right, I got the Not drill. Not the big guns. I got the drill and I just, I'm curious. By the way, the knife was hidden in that corner too. But That's right. If you guys remember, there was a random knife just hidden right there in the corner. Before I do this, I gotta be in the proper mood. Let there be there LED okay. light. And mammoth teeth. Mammoth teeth and bones as well. All right, <laughs> here we go. So much treasure here. Are you excited to see what's back here? I am. Are you? Are you very much excited? Oh, come, on, come on, come on. Hopefully we can get it out. One screw. You go and count on me now? Yeah, is that okay? Or is it freaking you out? You always freak me out, but Two you're Two screws! You do whatever you want. <laughs> Three screws! So did you see this before? No, you know, I never even paid I attention to that. Until you pointed it out, never even like, looked what twice. Is that? Four screws! I'll stop counting like that now. No, you won't. You're right. Five screws. Hold that one. <laughs> Hold that one. Okay, for real this time, I'll stop counting like that. You'll count another weird way. <laughs> you think you know me, Jeremy? You think you know me? 
I know I know you. Okay. Look at these ones here. Look at that. Look how old that is with the cobwebs around it. Uh -huh. That was taken out. You see the gap there? Yeah. That, that's that been taken out. So that, that that's, that's evidence a, that's that a good they sign. have been, yeah. Oh, that one's stripped. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. We this could probably one. get it open with, with that screw in it. Probably. Don't you think? More coconut oil. <sighs> I didn't bring the pry bar. I'll go grab it. All right. One pry. We're going to pry it open since that screw's still stuck. Okay. BRB. I just pulled that screw. That may work. Here it goes. I think I got it. Okay. Last got it. screw. Okay. Thought you were going to stop. Yeah, I do know you. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, let Look me see. This. Let me see. Look at this. You okay. can definitely see the brick wall. Okay. We know we're in the right spot. All right. Take a look. Take a look around. Okay. What's, what's underneath? Anything? No, not that I can see. Okay. I think corners. that's. A, I think that's probably a clean out. And I didn't put my head all the way in, did you? Uh-uh. Look at this. Is that a rattletail? Rattlesnake tail? No, not a rattlesnake tail. Some type of bug. Uh, definitely a mouse nest. Uh, did you look up? Yeah. You have the light. I can't see anything. Up in there. You looked straight up the corner. What's in there? You're looking straight up the clean out. Yeah. Nothing there. Anything? Nothing there. Okay, that's... Should I try unscrewing this? Here, take the phone and get that back corner. Since you have longer arms than I do. How's that? I don't think that's going to come undone. All right, let's tear out that last wall. Okay. And then I'll figure out how to get that apart. We have an audience. When don't we? It's YouTube. They're everywhere. So no doubt the biggest question on everybody's mind other than did you find the $96,000 is how much damage did you do looking for it? Well, if you take a look here, I'm gonna guess roughly, probably 90, thank <laughs> you. $96,000 worth of damage looking for it. Let's, let's go inside. Let's go see all the space now. George? Jeremy? George? Jeremy? George? Can you find me? George? It's one big open room. George? You shouldn't have a problem finding me. Oh, you're all the way over there. Surprise! Look at all this openness. Look at Open all... This demolition dust. That's not going anywhere. Pull that panel. See that there? That. Oh, I thought this was a closet. Is the hot water heater? Never mind. Right on top of a fire ant hill. But guess what? Chicken butt. Yes, and I found the back door. Do you want to see it? Yeah. All right. Head that way. Okay. The open area. Now we do have loose cords. We'll take care of all that. I'll do electrical you can just later. Under there. Yeah, that's always fun. A lot of the lumber I'll use to make shelves. George. Am I going this way? That is it. That is the back door. The back door and then this overhang was enclosed in and no back door was put into it. So technically, this is a side door. No, technically, that was the back door. Woo, the demolition dust is crazy. Oh, wait, where's she going? She wants me to knock this wall out next. All right, side back door. Are you knocking this wall down too? Here we go. On the endless pursuit to Just find curious. some money. What do you think, George, about hosting a metal detecting meetup here 
on the property for all viewers and fans. Instead of just going to some random place, why don't we invite them all here with their metal detectors, see what they can find on their own treasure on the property. Now, has any YouTuber ever done a meetup that epic before? Not that I know of, but it all sounds right. pretty epic. To be continued.